and I've always wondered what the top speed of my RSV4 factory ultra dark would be. We might be able to find out. buzzing by cars, you know, especially when I'm by myself, I always have this fear that they're just going to jump into my lane for really no reason, so maybe we'll have to try the top speed run a little later on. Well, hey everybody, today I'm in Pennsylvania riding with some of my good buddies, including Randy's Reality, my good buddy Corey, and their crew of people on these amazing bikes. Pennsylvania rides in this area. And I also love dancing with my good buddy Corey here. He has a Kawasaki Ninja H2. Super light guy. Today he's riding Randy's Jixxer 750. As my 1000 struggles to keep up with him because of his light weight. But if the roads clear up, I intend to teach him a lesson that he won't soon forget. skyline of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, because it always looks amazing, and I always seem to catch it in different types of light. What a beautiful skyline, and it looks even more remarkable from up top, the Mount Washington scenic overlook. Yeah, so a variety of bikes showed up, <laughs> all different types, but most of them have parts supplied to them by Miami Nanny and Motor Million. 
Some of them used discount code 650E, some of them did not. You make sure if you're viewing this video that you always use discount code 650E to save money on parts at Motor Million. So I guess this is an impromptu group ride that we just sort of collected from guys that met at the Mount Washington Scenic Overlook and now, of course, Smackdowns have to happen. This guy's black S1000 looks amazing with the Duca bike. Clear clutch cover from Motor Million. It's a great looking bike. I'm really surprised I don't see more of the black S1000s, you know, the 2023s on the road. But why not? Because uh, the colorways for the 2024s are exactly the same as the 2023. Only difference is they added an SOS button to the handlebars of the bikes. That should be pretty interesting. There's even a little microphone and a speaker on the handlebar. So in case you have uh, some sort of agricultural experience, you can call for help. Ride! 